As mentioned, anything less than a win here really puts Zimbabwe in some peril. They would basically be resigned to trying for third place. Here is the Uganda lineup as they look for their second straight. Victory at AFCON on Yango in goal. He is also the club captain. Says his familiarity playing with a bunch of these Zimbabwe players in the African leagues that gives his side a little bit of the edge. Okwi and Kadu, the goal scorers in that opening match, they'll be looked to uh, to provide some of the offensive power in this game along with Farouk Nia, who's uh, one of their better players also playing in the second striker position for Zimbabwe. Looking to build off of what happened versus Egypt. And if they play the same way they did against Egypt, you have to think they're going to provide some problems to Uganda as they come out in the 4-1-2-3 formation. Biliats and Musona. You guys to keep an eye on Karuru and Kamusoko in behind Musona who will lead the line at the top. captains and the officials for this one. As we mentioned a number of times, no video-assisted referee in the group stage. Now that will come in at the quarterfinals of this tournament. And Sebastian Saab, the coach 